back here weekly. <laughs> and I miss y'all. It wasn't the rash, but thank you for the idea and the thought, because I was trying to figure that thing out, but it's better now. It still feels like, to me, it has like a little bit of a white coat, but I'm working on it. I guess nobody tongue at 44 years old is completely pink. But it sure wasn't supposed to be white and coffee colored. Mm -mm. <laughs> Like yeah. Um, the 15th and 16th load days. Right now, I'm currently doing uh, the military diet. I started that today. I gotta go get me. Uh, I would be eating right now, but I don't have a grapefruit. So I gotta go get me a grapefruit today, and I gotta get me one banana. I think that's all I need. I think I have everything else, but I have to check the counter, the cabinet. So, I'm going to end up having, ooh, I'm going to end up having like a really late breakfast, which is going to turn into a late lunch, which is going to make dinner late, but then tomorrow I'll be eating around this time, because I have everything. But, um, yeah. I am still between 12 and 14 pounds up, so I'm going to get the military diet to knock that down. Then I'm going to eat healthy until it's time for me to load up. And then balls to a wall. I'm doing it like I did it the very first time. Because I need to go ahead and get some more weight off. Because I'm trying to put more weight on. And I'm not trying to, but it's just what my 44 year old body is doing. And me don't like it. <laughs> not at all. Not even a little bit. Um, so I'm just checking in. Um, oh, I've been going to the gym every day this month. You know, gotta keep it real. March was not a good month. <laughs> it was a good month. It was my birthday month, but I, I phoned everything in March. I'm supposed to be doing a video every day, like a movie type video every day, and I stopped doing that. I just like phoned everything in last month. I was going through some things, and then I just didn't feel like it. And so now. I gotta get back on my third dizzle. So on the 14th that night, I'm gonna do my measurements, I'm gonna weigh and everything, and that's gonna be my tip off point, whatever that is. And I'm gonna take it from there. I don't have no end goal other than the fact that I want to be smaller than what I am now. Because I feel like I'm bigger than what I was this time last year. And I am heavier, so obviously I am bigger. But um, 14 pounds is not showing me that it's showing me, you know what I'm saying? But the scale ain't going to lie to me. Mr. Scale, if everybody else says you look good to one, Mr. Scale is going to be like, yeah, you look good, but you 14 pounds up, or you 12 pounds up. Because right now, currently, at this moment, I am 12 pounds up. But my highest was 14 pounds up this year. Like, I put 14 pounds up this year. And I haven't gotten it off, and we're in April. So, yeah, the summer is, like, right there. And I want to be back here. I don't think I'm going to work as much as I did last summer, which means this is going to be, like, a summer to just hang out with my baby and, and just do a little bit of work in the morning and then pour into my daughter all summer long because, you know, she only got one more year of middle school. And then it's off to high school. Where peer pressure is a mud, but the devil is a liar. My daughter is strong like her mama, and she will not fall for temptation and peer pressure. In Jesus' name. Yeah, put that prayer real, real fast. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, um, I'm going to the gym when I get off the bus this morning. And I've been to the gym, like I said, every day this month. I'm working on. Mainly my arms. I'm trying to bench press. But y'all know I got them going. Now, I don't hate them. They just what they is. Again, 44 years old right here. But um, if I can get them, like, toned a little bit. They ain't necessarily got to get um, smaller. But if I could tone them where they don't wiggle as much, that would be awesome. Uh, you know, a woman's bang, well, this woman's bang is that pooch at the bottom. So I've been working really hard on that, 
this month. Again, we're going to say this month. So it won't be like, oh, you've been doing all that work all this year and nothing happening. No, this month. <laughs> and, um, yeah, it's like four something in the morning. My goal is to, for all of this month, be in the bed no later than nine and be up no later than 4.30. Get back on my schedule like I used to be. And some mornings do my floor exercise here. Some mornings go to the gym before my um before I go to work. And the rest of the time just I'm just up. So I can get my body back to being up like that. The reason I'm not at the gym right now is because I have to put gas in the bus and I know that I don't have time to go work out, then go to the bus and then go get gas. I don't have time to do that. So I'm not gonna do it today. But tomorrow dog. I gotta do my extra stuff during the day tomorrow, so I have to go first thing in the morning to get it in, and I'm going every day. But I'm not gonna do the bench pressing every day, but I wanna do at least five days a week, so I'm gonna take today off of the bench pressing, and then the rest of the week I'll probably do it and then maybe take Saturday off. No, I'm gonna take. Sunday off because that's when I'll be traveling to Beham to get my baby mama. Yeah, uh, but they have a gym in the hotel. We stay in Beham for two days, and they have a gym in Beham so at the hotel. So I'm still gonna get a workout in. I just won't be at my gym, but I will get my workout in. So. Anyway, that's what's going on with me, but I'll catch up with y'all this time, time next week. So and I'll probably have my baby mama sitting right here, standing right there, over here at the table. But she'll probably be in it with me. All right, I'll holler.